I'm a Sergeant First Class Van. I was Distinguished Honor Graduate for Class 006-21 for MLC. In regards to This Is My Squad, I think that's a great program. It helps people remember that despite the Army being a very large organization and very process driven, it still comes down to the people. And like I was telling my classmates, the best tool you have is your mind. That is what makes you lethal, that's what makes you be able to think around problems, come up with solutions, and be an asset to the organization uh, and those around you. I tried to impart some of my experience and time overseas. I got six deployments uh, with Special Forces, and it was very helpful for me because I've worked at a theater special operations command as an LNO for our group. And I've also worked in Afghanistan and combat operations at the ODA level. Also worked for Department of State on Title 22 in Iraq. Went to Africa and did combat patrols and stuff in that area of the world. And did a bunch of joint combined exchange trainings, CNTs in Latin America. So my experience and skill sets definitely helped me in this course. And I feel like I was ahead of my peers coming into the course. One thing I noticed was that a lot of people with the depth process they want you to do here with the describe, explain, and then provide examples. The examples were very easy for me because I had done a bunch of different kinds of things, but the challenge is describing and explaining it. One thing that I think a lot of people struggled with was operational design, uh, operational art, joint planning process, DOD strategies, and our the Special Force Senior Leader course touches on the DOD strategies and I feel like I was ahead in that and the joint planning process is very much like the military decision making process that some of us in the military use more than others. I'm very thankful for my experiences both with all the military, military training as well as deployments. Uh, I would say if someone is trying to prepare for the course, I would look up the manuals and just read about the joint planning process, operational design, operational art, and I would also look at DOD strategies, and I think that would better prepare you when you came here to do better in those sections that it seems like uh, some of my classmates struggled more with. It was a lot of work, a lot of effort. This course is very labor intensive. It's not that it's a super difficult course, but there's a lot of information, a lot to digest in a very short amount of time. So I think if, if you remember the This Is My Squad program and, and think of your classmates as your squad mates, um, and then whatever family support you have, whether it's your wife, kids, any of that, they just need to realize that you'll be extremely busy at least for the first, if not both weeks of the course and you need to devote all your time to be successful in this course, otherwise you won't be distinguished honor grad or top 20%. If you come into this course and you have a lot of distractions and other stuff going on, uh, you will be struggling to pass. So I would devote plenty of time to the course, uh, study up on those things if you're concerned about it, and do your best and, and see where things shake out. So I appreciate the opportunity to talk to all of you. Hopefully you come here and are also successful. Uh, like I ended up being. Thanks.